Okay, so here we are. We have another ball workout, and it's for abs. Now today, we're doing obliques only. So we're gonna work on those love handles. Unfortunately, that we call, it's what we call, you know, there's a bunch of names for them, but we're just gonna get right into it. So we have 10 moves, 45 seconds each, okay? So are you ready? You're gonna come down to the ball. You're gonna lay on it on your right side, okay? So now, there's a couple options here so you can get used to this. Hand on the floor and knee on the floor. Left hand behind the head, okay? Now, what you're gonna do is lift and crunch. Now, if you want this to be harder, don't go yet. Hands behind your head, lift. Now, if you feel like you're wiggling all over, maybe two fingers on the floor, if the hand is too much, okay? So there's always options, you ready? Move number one, here we go. Up. So again, you can do this with the hand on the floor. Just don't press into the hand. And I want you to think about the muscle that you're working, right? Squeeze it. Don't just do the move. Lift it. So yes, you're going to feel your abductor a little bit too. And if you're like, what is my abductor? That's the side of your butt there, right? Up. Keep going. You lift. Good. And I want you to think about it. This wonderful, lovely spot that we all love so much. I get so many questions about that. And lift, what do we do about that? And up, good. Lift, you got it, you got it. Up. Lift, come on. And last one, perfect. So we're gonna go right to the other side. Right, bring it right over. Twist my mic around, okay. Laying on it, hand to the floor or not. Ready? Here we go. Up and down. So again, it can be here, right? Or it can be here. Whatever feels best. What it is, though, is you're going onto your side, right? You're not rounding over your ball here, okay? Keep going. Up and lift. Good. So you should feel, again, right here. The obliques on your side there. Come on. Up. Keep going. And lift. Nice. Bringing it up. Not pulling on the neck. You're lifting those shoulders off the ball. Good. Up. You can do this. Oh, yes. Good. Give me one more. Fantastic. Now, listen, you're going to go back to your right side, but this time, the ball is going between your feet, okay? So, ball between your feet. Now, when you look at your feet, one, the bottom foot should be right under the top foot. You don't want it like this. See the difference? Now, you're gonna lay all the way down, all the way down on your arm. Put your fingers in front of you. You're gonna lift, pushing the bottom foot into the ball. Ready? And here you go. So, we're lifting. Oh, bleaks. Come on, up. Yes. Perfect. So a quick oblique workout. Bring it up. Then I promise that you're going to feel just a little the first time you do this. Up. Now, do you want it a little more challenging? If you do, one finger on the floor. If you want a little more, bring that arm up. Now, you might wiggle around a little bit. Find your center so that that stops, right? Come on, up, ooh, lift. You should feel again right here. You might feel a little inner thigh too, but your lift is coming from your oh, obliques. Give me one more. Nice, guess what? Other side, ah, okay. So just swing it around. There you go, so again, make sure that one foot is right under the ball and the other foot is right on top of the ball. You're laying all the way down. Ready, here you go, lift, and up. So find it, and maybe little by little, you take the decision, two fingers in front. Maybe you just take baby steps from two fingers to one finger, to arm up, all right? If the arm comes up and that bottom foot comes forward, put your feet back down, okay? Up, up, keep going. Lift. You got this, guys. Come on. 
Nice. Lift. You're almost there. Come on, up. Push. Three. And done. All right. All right, all right. We're going to come to your ball. All right, your next move, you're going to lay on top of your ball. Hands are behind your head. And you're going to lift up. Hold it. You're going to reach and reach. So try to reach for the knee, crunching to your sides. Ready? Here we go. Crunch, crunch, crunch. So keep going. That should be here, here, right? The front of your oblique. Stay with it, stay with it. Crunching up, you got it, you got it. Up, side to side, good. Side, good, lift it up. Try not to arch over your ball. Keep going, everybody, you can do this. Stay with it, up and up. Woo, come on. Again, pelvis tilts, bring it up. Focus through it. You can do it. Three, two, and one. All right. So you're gonna over. Here we go. Ready? Over. Lift. Yes. We're getting it all in. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Cross. Good. Again, you're not arching over it. Okay. And your butt is not going down and up with it. All right. You work at the abs here. Let's go. Over. Yes. Push. Come on. We can do it. Up. And up. Come on, you're almost there. And guess what, right? We only do these moves. Up. Only a few more moves left, right? So we're only doing them twice each. You don't have to do it again unless you really want to. You can rewind it and do it again. Up. Last one, stop. Okay, you're rolling forward so that your head is on the ball. Head is on the ball. Arms are up. All right, so we're right here. You got that? Now, press into your feet. You're going to turn onto your right shoulder and then back to the center and then turn onto your left shoulder. Okay? Maybe don't make it as big the first time just in case. You don't want to feel like you're going to fall off. Okay, ready? Here we go. So arms are up. You slowly go to one side. Back to the center, balance, and then go to the other side. Up. Really press firmly into your feet. Good, back up. Over. Back to the center, you can do this. Come on. Yes. Again, you don't need to go fast to feel this. You're twisting your torso. Keep going. Woo. Over, back, over, and back. Last one. Over, and nice. Okay, we're gonna move to the floor. All right, move it to the floor. Now, you could absolutely do this move without the ball, and that would be arms out, knees going side to side. Okay, otherwise, your ball is going between your feet, right up here. Arms are out to the side. These are windshield wipers. You're gonna go to one side for two, and back up, and then to the other side, and back up, okay? So, are you ready? The answer is always yes, ready? Here we go. Over, and down. Now, when you go over, you do not lift the opposite shoulder. So if you go down and this whole side of your body comes up, don't go so low. Over and up. Come on. Over. Up. Now if you need to go slower, that is absolutely fine. Come on. You can do it. Over and up. Nice. Breathe. So breathe in as you go down. Breathe in here. Breathe out. Yes. Breathe in. Breathe out. You got this. Come on. Over and up. Give me one more, one more. Over and up. Nice. Put your ball on the floor. Put your feet on top. All right. Let me get back on my mat. Hold your shoulders up. You're going to reach to one side. 
than the other side. Here we go. One side. So your shoulders stay lifted and you crunch to the side. To the side, come on. Over, let's go. Reach and reach, come on. You got this, over. Push, nice. Keep going, keep going, come on, over. You're almost there. Good, again, no holding your breath, push through it, up. One more each side. Last one. Oh, nice. All right, your last one is on your knees, okay? So, if you cannot have your arms above your head, do without the ball, and you're gonna do side bends, and then back up, okay? Otherwise, arms are over your head. What you're gonna do is bring the ball over to the side like you're stretching, and then you're gonna bring it right back up, and then over to the other side, and up, okay? Only go as far as it feels comfortable for you. You want to feel those obliques working. Tilt the pelvis, squeeze your butt. You go over, up, over, okay? And you see how I'm bending to the side and I'm not doing this? There is a difference. Over and up. Now you want it to be controlled so that you're not going forward here. All right, the arms are next to the ears. And now again, if you can't have your arms over your head for any reason, you can go here. Okay, another one you can do is have your hands in your imaginary suspenders and go to the side and then back up to the side and then back up. I don't know about you, but I am feeling my obliques. Keep going. Over. And you know we're doing all of these one more time, right? Last one and stop. All right, guys, here we go. Get your right side on the ball, starting from the top. You know the moves now. Hand on the floor, hand behind the head. Lift up, up, up. Remember, one finger, no fingers, right? Up, good, keep it going right to the side here. You can do it, lift, up. Good, keep going, keep going. Now, I know, I know, you probably heard me say it before. You can't crunch away a bad diet, right? So, what do I believe? I believe that your diet should be, not a bad word, number one, okay? Number two, as much real food as possible. Okay, and stop, good. So some people are like, what does that mean, real food? It means, well, look at your ingredients in your food. If there's a bunch of stuff in your food that you don't know what it is, don't eat it. Ready? Up. Up. Here we go. Lift. And again, this hand can be on the floor. Lift it up. It's up to you, right? Good. So, for instance, say you buy some kind of frozen chicken, right? You buy frozen chicken. You're like, chicken. Good. And then you look at those ingredients, and on the back of that chicken, there's like sodium by blah blah blah. What? I just made that up, obviously. Okay. Put it away. Buy some real chicken, right? You want food that's just food. Up. That will make a huge difference in your body, I promise you. And stop. Okay, you're going back to your right side. You're going to put that ball between your feet. Lay down. When you're ready, up, up, good. And anytime you need to pause between the moves, if you need to, please do. Arm up, if you want, right, that's an option. And remember, you're pressing your bottom foot up into that ball to lift from your oblique here, lift, come on. I feel like I'm gonna feel these tomorrow, or well, right now, come on, and lift, come on. Up, you got this, up. Keep it going. Oh, come on. Woo. Finish this one up. Push through. You're almost there. And stop. Yes, you will feel your ab and adductors inner and outer thigh on that. Go right to the other side. 
Get yourself there. I'll give you a second to get there. Isn't that nice of me? <laughs> Stop moving so fast. Ready? So get in your position. And here we go. Okay, good. Again, if you like, arms straight up, right? Good. But if that messes with your form and you feel it more somewhere else than in your obliques, I want you to think about it, right? Imagine it. Imagine that muscle right here, right on your side. Keep going. Up. Up. Come on. Ooh, I'm wiggly. <laughs> Good. So the other thing is, maybe you had it. Maybe you're like, I got this. And then you start to lose form. That means you're tired. If you're losing form, put your hand back down. Up. Come on. Up. One more. Very nice. All right. Guess where we're going? We're getting up on top of your ball. All right. Here we go. So come up. Lay on it. Okay. Hands behind your head. You're going to reach side to side. Okay. Now that ball should not be going anywhere with you, right? Side to side. Over. Good. Keep your shoulders lifted. Come on. Over. Crunch it. Yes. Who's going to have strong abs? You are. Let's go. Let's go. Over. Good. Think about it. Keep your pelvis tilted. You can do this. Come on. Push, push, push. Nice. Three, two, one. Cross crunch. Over. Over. Here we go. Ready? Over. Lift. Yes. We're getting it all in. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Cross. Good. Again, you're not arching over it. Okay? And your butt is not going down and up with it. All right? You're working the abs here. Let's go. Over. Yes. Push. Come on. We can do it. Up. And up. Come on. You're almost there. And guess what? Right? We only do these moves. Up. Only a few more moves left. Right? So we're only doing them twice each. You don't have to do it again unless you really want to. You can rewind it and do it again. Up. Last one. Stop. Okay. You're rolling forward. Head is on the ball. Work on this position here. Ready? Over to one side. Over. Okay. This is one of those that you're like, I don't think I'm going to be able to do this. You practice. See this Charlie's Angels hands? Yeah? I want you to be Charlie's Angels. <laughs> and over. All right? I want you to be tough. Push through it. All right, now, yeah, if you feel pain, that's different. But if you're like, oh, I don't think I can do it, right? Just do a little bit, just move to one side a little bit. And then little by little, the very first time I did this, I definitely was about to fall off the ball. Over, and nice. Okay, we go to the floor. We've got those windshield wipers. Okay, so put the ball between your feet. Otherwise, you just do this without the ball. Okay, arms outside. Keep those shoulders down. Ready? One side you go. Two. And up. Over. And up. Good. You got this. And press your arms firmly into the floor. Ooh, come on. Yes. Stay with it. Over. I love working with the ball. I find that I get a lot out of it. All right. Just different moves. Having a piece of equipment that you can use, right? That works stabilization, right? Works balance. It's not really heavy. Although right now it feels a little heavy. You have the last one here, last one here. Oh, good. Put your feet back on it. Okay, ready? We're going those slow side crunches. Shoulders up. You go. Side and back. 
side and back. Let's do it. Side, back. Good, reach for it. Over. Come on. Smile, yes? Because after this, there's only one more move. Yeah, come on. Gonna finish this up. So now with this and the first ab ball workout, you have two ab workouts under your belt. Okay, keep going. Over, over, you're almost there. One more. Perfect. All right, everybody, get up, get up. Last one on the knees. If you can't bring the arms over the head again, you just put the hands here or behind your head. Here it is, ready? Hips forward, squeeze your butt, we go. Over, and up. Good, bend at the waist. Up, nice. Over, and up. Let's go. Over, and up. You can do it, you can do it. Over, up. Yes, come on. Ooh, push. Over, and up. Work it. Nice. We're almost there. Keep remembering, this is the last move. Don't, don't die out on me. Don't die out on yourself. Stay with it. Stay with it. You got it. You know what we're going to do? One more on each side. Just because we can, you're going to go about a second over the timer. One more. And you are done. Yes. All right, come on up to standing. Ah, release through your back. Release, release. Nice. Bring your arms up. Reach over to one side. Press down. So I think the left, left arm up. Press down through your left foot. Get a little longer stretch. That's it. Four, three, two. Other side. Press down through your right foot as you stretch to the left. Excellent. Four, three, two, and one. Good. Shake it out. You guys, second ab workout down. I will see you tomorrow. Thank you again. Bye-bye.